Welcome back to City Line Summer Sizzle. So we're back with Chef MDP, who did get me to agree that fish and fruit should have a lovely marriage for life. Thank you very much. So we're going to do Thank it you. again. This time, what are we marrying? So we're doing grilled, uh, beautiful salmon skewers with a bit of spice yeah. and some sweetness and some freshness. Ontario local summer uh, strawberry salsa. Salmon and strawberry. Salmon and strawberry. It sounds like a beautiful With a little bit of heat. We got a little heat going on. Absolutely. Speaking heat. Speaking heat. So again, grill tip 101. You know, yep. fire the grill, preheat the grill. Yep. We're about 350, 400 kind of thing. Okay. You can always, again, reduce heat after. We're putting oil. So we've canola oiled on a brush or and on a napkin. Yeah. A paper towel. You're just brushing it on. Why? So we don't want our salmon and so forth to stick. No sticky. No sticky. Mm hmm. No ticky. Here we go. So <laughs> let's get right in. Sous chef, uh, tea, if I what may. What am I doing? What am I so, doing? Right, there's so much to grab here. It's just like right. everywhere. A little bit of honey. We're making our marinade mm. first. So if that's a little drizzle, actually, if you need a spoon, go go crazy. Just a little As bit. you're doing this, I'm going to sneak over your shoulder, and we've got a little bit of canola. Okay. So I'm going to go in here. We're just getting a squeeze on. This is to marinate. You're doing about you know quarter of a cup. Cayenne. Okay. I like that. You're that's good. You gotta taste as you go. That's you're right. Licking, you're licking your fingers with that honey as you should. So cayenne for some heat. So I'm yep. gonna do a little salt and pepper to taste. Nice. Right? Thank you. And we'll do a fresh lime. Amazing. Your dedication oh, is fantastic. This is good. Sous chef T, you're fantastic. Thank you. So you're we've welcome. got our marinade. We're just gonna pull the side for a second. Thank you. Now let's take one off that we've already done. Okay. And I just want to show you. So we're starting with our salmon, so beautiful coho Pacific salmon. It's gorgeous. It is, right? Look at the color of that flesh. It is stunning. This is a sustainable BC uh, Pacific Coast salmon. Uh -huh. So again, when we're looking for our seafood, we want sustainably sourced. You know, we want to support local as much as possible. Yeah. Um, and we've been able to do so. So I would normally be slicing this into cubes, and you can see what I've done here. So I've yeah. got them set skin ready on, to go. Right? Skin on, right? Skin on. I love skin on. Let's just do this. We're gonna pull them. I've already cut them, but we just want to marinate. Oh, I see. Right, just to get an idea of what we're doing. Again, yeah. the beautiful thing is we are on TV, so we're working a bit ahead. Yeah. Rule number one in the kitchen too. We're working smart, right? Yeah. Like cleaning as I go. I love this. Please show my kids that. Please, okay. Like, like kids, just the watch little this. bit of tidiness throughout the Goes recipe, a long way. and Goes then a long at the way. end, it's not like you know. So it is not like you know. Fireworks exactly. went off in the kitchen. Katy Perry, fantastic. Yes, <laughs> KP. So if I can, I'm going to keep this salmon just a little bit. But can you just drizzle that over top, please? Sure. Thank you. Lovely. So this is our beautiful drizzle. marinade. So again, you've got heat, you've got sweet, you have that honey. Yeah. That honey is going to caramelize on there as well. So barbecue's up. We're rocking. Let's get this right onto the hot grill. Oh, if yeah. If you just jump over, I'm going skin side down first, okay? Why is that always the situation? You just don't want to essentially, you want to give it time to cook through, and I, want, I don't want to burn it. Okay. So skin down, one flip. The okay. thing with salmon, again, similar. I like to cook it two to three minutes per side. Yeah. Um, don't go too crazy here. So it's a little, it's a little heartier though than a shrimp. It yeah? is. It can stand up to a little more heat. Let's yeah. jump over to our salsa. Let's do it. Right. Let's do it. So here we go. Let's move this out of the way. We're cleaning up. Okay. On the board, if I may, Chef T, please. Yeah. So we've got a cup of beautiful local Ontario strawberries beautiful. going right in. Thank you. Red onion, finely chopped, nice yeah. and diced. Okay. I already love this, this combination. This is going to be beautiful, already. right? I'm going to add yeah. a little more canola as well, just to bring that together. Can I please go with jalapeno? Yeah, all of it, right? All of it. Let's go. So that's the heat. Is the heat. Yeah. So again, you could omit that if you want. Yeah. Do we like to keep our, do you like heat? I like heat. Yeah, me too. Yeah, keep it all. But you know what? If somebody doesn't want to keep heat, they yeah. can actually just remove the seeds. The seeds are where it's nice and hot, right? That's where it gets hot. Yeah, it gets where it gets a little alicante. So Beautiful. we're in the backyard party. Let's just get nice and loose here. I'm Thank trying you. to clean this. You are doing such a fantastic job. You could be in the kitchen with me any single day. Thanks. And here I'm in your kitchen today. So let's just bring that through. The colors through. on that. It's stunning. That's beautiful. Can you just see that? Like absolutely stunning. It's gorgeous. We're going to see this. We're going to put this on our plate. I'm going to get you mm -hmm. to be our official salsa queen there. So I'm going to do distribute the salsa. You are going to be the distributor of the salsa. So the salmon is absolutely good, cooked. Chef. We have a couple going off already. Uh -huh. I'm going to add just a wee base of a little base of uh, rocket here. Okay, nice. Arugula, a little yep. bit of spice in that. Yeah, it's got a bit of a, like arugula's always got a little bit of a It has a bitterness to it. Back. It's almost like a little pepper. I like it, and it's really good for you. It's so good for your digestion. It is, clears you out. This is how I, my, I look so good. I this live is off arugula. Why? Arugula. Let's look at this plate. So arugula, you know the Brits call, in Britain they call it rocket. 
They call it rocket. They do. Yes. Don't ask yes. me why. So I know. I have seen that. Can I just get you to do a beautiful again drizzle, sort of over top salsa? So you've got the I don't spiciness. Know if I'm do it right. You can. I know you can. Yeah. Look at this, all pro. <laughs> I wanted Look at this. it to this be is like, great. No, this is yeah. like a Jackson Pole painting. I mean, that's perfect. This is, you know what? Cooking is fun. We're in the backyard. It's summertime. Fantastic. There. Okay, beautiful. This is a lovely dish. I want to talk a little bit about when you were picking your salmon. Yeah. I know you said to go local. Yep. Do you have a fishmonger? I do. So you I have do. a fishmonger here. All the cool the, kids do. You do. You should have a good butcher that you trust. You should yeah. have a fishmonger that you trust. You know, find a fishmonger that you ask questions and they answer to you. Okay. So the thing with seafood, sustainable seafood, we want to make sure where they're always asking questions. Yeah. You know, it's not sustainable seafood and or beef or anything doesn't necessarily have to be expensive yeah you just need to ask and shop at the right places absolutely so I always say to friends you know just ask more of your suppliers yes ask more of where you're buying it from yeah absolutely you know? so this is gorgeous mm -hmm. you've got a whole balance happening you've got the sweet you've got the heat I'm going to try it I think you should Let's I want to you... know if you were to make this at home how long would this whole thing take because that was very quick Okay, so if you're making this from start to finish, I'm yeah. honestly going, you know, the salmon's only taking max five minutes. I made that salsa almost in a lifetime that's hot. Mm -hmm. That caramelization of the honey, that mm -hmm. sweetness, that heat of cayenne. Can mm -hmm. I jump in here with you too? Mm -hmm. Get a little bit of that salsa. It is a backyard party, so there's one rule. Mm -hmm. No forks or knives. You just, oh. you eat with your hands. Just be an Get, animal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it's you know a backyard what I mean? party. It's a backyard party. There could be raccoons. We got to feed everybody. Uh-huh. So, wow. this is another marriage that's going to work. They're going to go the distance. MDP, thank you so much for that. Two for